This is part three of Mastering Data Frames with Row64 using Python. In this series, we explore how to load data, sort it, and manipulate data to prepare it for data analysis. I'm your host, Paul Trin. Thanks for joining me. Hey guys, Paul Trin here with another uh, Row64 tutorial on how to reorder uh, columns uh, inside of a pandas data frame. Uh, we're gonna show you how to do that in Python, and then we're gonna show you how to do that using Row64. So uh, if you guys haven't seen before, we've been talking a lot about. Uh, I've done other. I've done other tutorials where I've talked about how you load data, how you might want to change a specific cell or a specific uh, single value inside of a pandas data frame. Now we're going to talk about how to reorder um, reorder columns in using Python, but also using Row sixty four. So let's get right to it. Um, this is the data frame right here. Let's just bring up an easier example really quick I'm gonna do a new data frame real quick and you know just to load a data uh, show you can do recipes but let's go ahead and just do this load CSV and you can just put like a file path uh, row 64 has just has some default uh, data data paths and I'm just gonna run this and I'm gonna pull in three three columns right three <laughs> so anyway all right let's see uh, toggle over here to show you the Python and you know if you wanted to do a reordering of columns normally what you would do is you would do DF equals and then you just physically reorder the columns so uh, we read in um, this CSV so we would now choose this is the, this is the syntax you now choose the order in which you want to go in. So let's say we wanted to do uh, Y, then we wanted to do Z, and then we wanted to do uh, X, right? If I hit run now, um, here, you can see it's reordered. And the beautiful thing in row 64, you can go back and forth. See that? You kind of toggle the input versus the output. This DFN just isn't, is, if you change and you have a new data frame, it brings up this viewpoint so you can see what the input versus the output is. So that's how you reorder it. Pretty easy, you just basically signify what order you want things to go in. There are other ways to do more complex uh, reordering where you write more code and script it all out, but uh, this is the basic way to reorder, um, reorder columns. Let's go back to our other data frame that we've previously loaded that has a lot more, um, just way more columns. It becomes a lot more difficult to do something like that when you have a lot more features, right? It would just take forever for you to go through and reorder this. So Row64 actually has a really simple way to do that. You just click on your column and you move it. So if I want that over there, just move it over here. If I want to move it back, it's no problem. I can just hover my mouse over and pull it back to where it was before and drop it. So that's how you do it using Row64. Um, that's And this is the way you do it using Python. I hope you found that helpful. If you have any questions, please let me know and I'd be glad to help. Thanks so much.